cooking it now with the warm butter, lime, cucumber, um, which say, sounds say amazing. It again. Doesn't warm that sound so good? Warm butter, butter lime, cucumber, lime, cucumber lime salad. Dressing. Yeah. So we're, we're springing into spring. Yeah. So we want to make a salad. I just figured cucumber is one of the first ones up and, and radish is the first one up. We just Great. keep the salad super simple. And then just to like keep everything flavor forward, we're gonna go this albacore tuna, mm -hmm. which is sustainable. It's a Canadian product, yeah. and it's really, really dead easy to work with. This is a good follow-up after Frankie's segment because you're right. The radishes and the cucumbers are the first veggies you'll you'll get. You'll be able to harvest. Now make put them into a salad. You put can grow this stuff at home. Salad. You can make this, and you can make this in real time at home. It's okay. really quite simple. So this is the albacore. So this it's a is little important, bit, though. You have to get a really good fresh cut of fish. A fresh cut, and this is Canadian, so it's not flying mm. too far. I mean, it's West Coast, but it's okay, yeah. right? And then what this is, so this is this is a smaller tuna. It's basically the whole loin. The positive thing is, you really, to butcher it, you just cut a chunk off. Yeah. You don't really have to cut out steaks or anything like that. It's just, it's ready to go. You're just going to overly sesame it. I love that. And, and it just kind of sticks there because fish is, you know, a little light. And with this albacore, uh, opposed to regular tuna, is a little softer. Yeah. So it's going to stick right on there. Cool. Shake those off. And all we're to do is drizzle a little bit of olive oil. So the whole, this, you know, searing in a pan, pan searing, People do stay away from it because they, they're not 100% sure how you guys make it so that it's tender on the inside but a little bit crispy on the outside. This All is it is is time. It's just time. You know, get a bit of heat in there. You can hear the crackling, and that's what the sesame seeds are going to do too. It's going to be a texture play. Yeah. We don't want to serve the fish raw. We want to have a little bit of warm going on because we have the warm vinaigrette. Right. Speaking of which, okay. in my magical little copper pot here, believe it or not, this is just butter. It's just butter. It's just a little bit it's of butter. Tiny, tiny little, as I tell my wife, baby, it's just a little bit. Just yeah. relax. It's just a little bit. <laughs> but we're at the proper stage right now. So what's happening is in all butter, there's milk solids. Yes. And the milk solids clarify from the butter. And as you can see, the milk solids are floating up the top. And yeah. if you see in the bottom, you're just starting to caramelize there. It's starting to smell sweet. Doesn't that smell I great? Like. Mm -hmm. In about one minute, I, oh no, maybe I'm not going to do it in one minute. We maybe we're gonna just, do it now. Maybe I'm gonna do this now. You ready? Okay, let's do it now. It, you wanna do? It's well, starting to foam now. Yeah. So this is where all the flavor comes from. So when you're clarifying butter at home, you have to get that brownness. Yeah. On the bottom, and you have to get kind of like a foamy cappuccino thing. Okay. Oh my God, this makes French people really excited. Yeah. Well, it's happening right now, right in front of our eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a little fish here. Okay. And so now, as it's coming up, all we're gonna do: a little salt, right? Uh huh. A little pepper. Yeah. I'm gonna reach over you. Touch a lime. You see the bubbles? Yeah. And then boom. So it's all about the timing. It's this is the, the right timing. time to do it. So you add a little bit of the toasting. acidic thing going on. And what that's going to do, just take off the heat now. The lime juice will reduce, so get a little bit more acidic, mm -hmm. and it'll play just like a warm vinaigrette. Oh, nice. So now we need our dressing, Tracy. You got yes. a nice, beautiful cucumber in front of you? Yes, I do. What Vegetable will I do peeler. with this cucumber? We're going to teglatelli it. Try to get the okay. longest strands possible and, you know, into the bowl would be nice. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> you know, take away a stab. There, she got it, she got it. It's okay. It's working on it. You know. And it's the beautiful thing, you can go as deep as you want in the cucumber, but basically what you're going to do is... My pieces you, are so thin. Oh, so are yours. Yeah, okay, no, the thing, it's, it's, right. like, it's like a fettuccine or yeah. tegatelli or it's a, whatever you want to call it, a pappardelle. Yeah. You know, it's just strands. Okay. It's something you can do, and more importantly, the kids can probably do it as well. That's right. Get them chopping and using these instruments early on so they don't turn out like Tracy Moore. <laughs> you're doing a great job. Get them in that there. kitchen. You're doing a great job. Okay, so do I have enough strands? We need a little bit more. Come oh, okay. A little bit more. Got it. And then dill. And this just gets broken up. This because is you so want nice and fresh, though. And you I love the fact freshness? that you're putting the cold ingredients with the warm vinaigrette. It's going to all melt together. It's all going to melt together. I had this for lunch yesterday. Yeah. It was pretty fantastic. I was going to ask you guys. Yeah. So you test your recipes the night before when you come to City Line, yeah. don't you? Well, and we then you guys make eat it all. Times. We eat it and we got to, you know, play with it. Yeah. And, uh, and just try it out. And what I can't believe is really this, this salad has four ingredients. Yeah. But it came together and it was just like this magical thing. Okay. So, They're wrapping us up, Randy. Yeah, you know, that always happens. So do we do you want me to put some olive oil in here or anything like that? Are we gonna save it? You ready? We're gonna save the vinaigrette. All I want you to do, so we're gonna do this. Three beautiful pieces of tuna, perfectly okay. carved up. You ready? Ready. Hello. So we got one. So beautiful. Two. Oh, that you so did this one up. like a little sun, I like that, and but that's still good. Right on top. Okay. You ready? But I want to do it the way you usually do it. You're Try like, to stack it as high as you can. Like that. Oh, not bad. That looks good. Right? 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 Yeah. And then that warm dressing. Oh, yeah, baby. 
And that just melts all the flavors oh, together. The so herbs good. come through and it's like, hey, how you doing?